and everything what is your inside mind we will discuss now first of all you can see that in this corner i have put some brown color stones uh, i got these stones from my local nursery shop and uh, i have made some hiding places for the fries especially uh, and here i have uh, a driftwood and i have attached java moss on it uh, java moss is getting a little bit rotten uh, because it is maybe due to summers uh, or some weather conditions uh, some months ago it was very green but i don't know what is happening to it uh, now here we have some stones and i have put the stone around this uh, uh, in the center of my tank i have put some pearl bead and it is growing very well and behind that i have the figure ribbons and here is a driftwood and behind the driftwood i have put some round stones and i have made the rocks and uh, it is very good for the fries for adding specially and here i have put a piece of artificial grass and above that there is some guppy grass and this is hornwort uh, it is just starting growing and in the front i have put the sad grass okay guys now we talk about what are the essential for breeding guppies uh, first of all guys you have to maintain good water quality uh, especially you have to keep the nitrate and ammonia levels very low and for that purpose i do water changes on regular basis uh for example in my case i do 30 to 40% water change after 3 days and it is very essential for the breeding and guys the second thing that is most important in breeding is the hiding places uh, as you can see that i have many hiding places like stone plants and driftwood and other things like that and i will make a detailed video on everything about plants driftwood but you can have a review on my tank that how i have set it and what are the places uh, guys now we talk about what i feed them uh, i have this feed this is a simple feed 3 in 1 uh, you can get any uh, you can get from any fish store i feed the fish is this feed and for the fries especially i have grind this this feed and i give them in this powder form and i have also grind the dried shrimps for the high protein level uh, i use this for the fries and i usually feed once or two times in a day uh, this is very good and especially for the fries because they get a very good size and they get very bigger in a mostly in two weeks uh, that's all for today and i will make new video about this tank and please comment about this and if you have anything in your mind you can talk or discuss in the comments and we will be discussing everything related to the fishes and if you have any problems you can share your experiences or everything what is in your mind so we will be discussing everything uh, thank you for watching my video please subscribe and share and watch and also share with your friends thank you very much for watching aqua planet